the 5 km fee fall survivor. Larissa Savitskaya from Russia. Russia News, Newsroom. A military and a civilian airliner collided in Madeir 40 years ago. With a 20-year-old girl surviving the crash, landing in the Russian taiga and waiting for rescuers. A collision of two planes 40 years ago disturbed the calm of the far eastern sky near the town of Zavotinsk, 800 kilometers northwest of Vladivostok, on August 24, 1981. A 216K missile carrier aircraft collided with an N 24 RV passenger plane flying from Komsomolsk on Amur to Blagoveshensk, 910 km northeast of Vladivostok, 860 km northwest of Vladivostok. The military jet, on the other hand, was only conducting intelligence weather reconnaissance. Several unlucky circumstances conspired to cause the incident. Each one was little in and of itself, but when added together, they yielded a significant result. Several unlucky circumstances conspired to cause the incident. Each one was little in and of itself, but when added together, they proved lethal. The planes crashed at a height of 5,200 meters at 3.21 p.m. The N-24's upper body and wings were lost, and its propeller cut the body of the 216K near the flight deck. The planes disintegrated and plummeted into the taiga. 37 persons died, including 6 military personnel, 5 and 24 RV crew members, and 26 passengers, including a child. The total number of passengers on the flights however, was 38. A 20-year-old teaching student named Larissa Savitskaya unexpectedly survived the accident.